All right, you guys, I was not expecting that in the shower, like. What's up, you guys? It's your girl, Yorellis, and welcome back to another Mask Monday video. So for today's Mask Monday video, we're gonna be testing out the main choice, amazing hair day, super smooth and extreme gleam, beautiful beaming mask. So this mask claims that it is for all hair types. So let's pull up some of these stats on this mask. It promotes natural hair growth and retention, minimal mines damage and breakage, instantly hydrates and moisturizes, strengthen, fight shredding and breakage which is perfect because you guys already know the weather's changing, it's getting colder, it's officially gonna be my first winter with my fully natural hair. So I'm really excited to try out all these different products to see which one's gonna hold up my hair very well. Now, I was really tempted to get like the full collection. They do have a glossy leave-in conditioner and they do have a perfectly polished gel, but I wanted to test this out by itself. That way I could see if it works with like my, you know, everyday go-to hair products. All right, so I'm going to section off my hair. This does have a floral scent to it. I smell gardenia in this. Does this have gardenia? Oh, the second ingredient in this is garcinia. So I think that's the same or it's related. And then the third ingredient is the rose of Jericho. So I do smell that a lot. It's, it's actually pretty strong. So if you're sensitive, you're probably not gonna like that. Ooh, and she is creamy. So she's thick. She's coming out really thick. So a little bit probably goes a long way. Oh yeah, this, <laughs> the scent on this is strong. Whoa, oh, chacho, it's not as strong. I will say though that my hair does feel soft. Every time I do a hair mask, I do like to twist my hair. That way I'm like training my curls for them to like, to get tighter, more defined. I feel like it really helps when you do that. So if you're transitioning, I would definitely recommend you twisting your hair. Yeah, definitely a little bit goes a long way with this product. It's really um, thick and heavy, so you really don't need that much. I always apply a little extra in the front area. So far, I do like the way my hair looks. It does look hydrated and moisturized, so we shall see. I smell it a lot though, like it's, it's pretty freaking strong. So first impression so far is that I like the way my hair feels. It feels really soft. It looks very moisturized, so it looks very promising. Um, it gave me a lot of slip. Y'all saw that. I was able to like, you know, comb through my hair. I was able to distribute it evenly. The only thing I will say is the scent is on the strong side. Like right now, it's, it's killing me. It's, wow. <laughs> it's so strong. So I am going to decondition like I always do. I like to put on a plastic cap. And I always go in with my little Amazon find. This is a satin bonnet. So all you do is, if you guys have never seen any of my videos before, all you do is, ow, just like something stabbing my eye. So all you do is you just put it over your head and then you tighten this. Make sure all your hair is in the bonnet. Pretty tight for me, before my head explodes. <laughs> and then you take the straps here and you put it under your chin. So it does say to cover your hair with a plastic cap, which I did, and sit under the dryer for 15 minutes. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go and grab my blower, attach it, and sit down for 15 minutes. And I will be back to show you guys the results before I rinse it out. So this is how my hair looks right now. It does feel soft, but I'm not gonna lie, it doesn't feel as soft as I thought it was gonna feel. All right, so I decided to bring you guys to the bathroom. That way you can really see how my hair looks right now. It looks really shiny. Like I said before, it doesn't feel as soft as I thought it was gonna feel. And I can tell too, like once I put water in my hair, it's gonna feel really nice and soft. So I'm gonna rinse this out and style my hair and then we'll talk. All right, you guys, I was not expecting that in the shower. Like, <sighs> oh my gosh. So these are my results after I styled my hair. It's fully dry. This side looks okay. You know, this side, however, I had a lot of trouble. Can you see how frizzy my hair is right here? It's super frizzy up here. Down here, forget it. It's It looks hella dry. It feels dry. 
look at this i can't believe how dry my hair looks there like that's insane it shouldn't even look like that after you know a mask it, sh it shouldn't have main choice it is not my choice i mean who else hates when their wash day doesn't go as planned like y'all know how long wash day is like give me a thumbs up if you can relate like i feel like maybe the products i used to style my hair just didn't go well with the mask but i already felt like we already had trouble in the shower like the fact that i rinsed that out and then i felt like we my hair just needed more moisture then when i was styling my hair my hair just kept drying up like crazy i kept putting water in it i don't know i just had a lot of trouble especially like on this side maybe like this isn't a great combo maybe i shouldn't style with like Aunt Jackie hair products. Maybe I should just stick to my Camille Rose stuff. Cause you know, sometimes you need to figure out the cocktails, you know? And then again, it could be like the season is changing. So my hair's reacting differently. I really don't know what it is. But I can tell you right now that I will not recommend this mask. I just don't, it's just not for me. It is a dub. It feels dry. I just had too much trouble, you know, styling it. It could be all the fragrance that's in this too. It has a lot of fragrance, way more than my other stuff, you know? And I just feel like for the price, it should have just been better overall. If we were to compare this to the Maui Moisture one, that was a hit and that was only like under eight dollars like are you kidding me and then this to be in the double digits like so that is it for today's video thank you so much for watching please give me a thumbs up if you guys are enjoying this mass monday series mass monday series <laughs> y'all know how many times i had to say that <laughs> if there's any products out there that you want me to try out leave them down below maybe i can check them out for you and of course i'll see you guys on the next one and don't forget to glow Mwah. bye you ain't gonna be glowing with this one though i don't think so sis